What's up everybody? Uh, it is Sunday, January 17th. I am finally not hungover. Uh, my birthday was this past Friday. Um, I spent most of the day yesterday pretty hungover and uh, kind of sucked, but hey, sometimes that's what happens. Uh, headed to the gym right now, trying a different gym today. I've been there before, uh, but it's a different 24. It's about 10 minutes away, so cruising out there right now. Um, Brittany gets home around 2.45, so I've got to head out to the airport to pick her up. And then we are going to grab some sushi and watch the Bronco game on our way back home. So.
What's up guys? Just got done uh, with another pull session. I know I did a pull session in my last video, um, but with being hung over yesterday, there was no way I could get it done. So got another pull session in, got some good footage done. It, it, it was kind of hard because uh, the gym was a little crowded, uh, especially with it being uh, right before the Broncos playoff game. Uh, so it's kind of hard to get the camera set up and people look at you all funny. I'm still getting over or you know trying to get used to uh, the feeling of you know vlogging in the gym <laughs> with people staring at you and me mugging and you know it is what it is but um, got most of my pull stuff done I didn't get biceps uh, I did a little bit of abs at the end but I didn't get the bicep stuff done um, but there's there'll be some pretty good footage on there it's kind of tough when you know I was doing deads and the camera of course fall down in the middle of the set and just stupid stuff like that so unfortunately not a lot of training content for this one, but uh, we'll make sure to bring the camera with me. I am headed home. I need to eat. I could definitely tell uh, from being uh, not feeling so hot yesterday that uh, my glycogen was definitely uh, depleted towards the end of the workout. So I'm going to head home, grab something to eat just real quick because I'm going to drive out to the airport to pick Brittany up. She's on her way back from Scottsdale. Um, pick her up and then we are actually going to like I said earlier grab some sushi on our way back so see you guys a little bit what's up guys Monday morning about 9 just about 10 o'clock I'm um, heading over to my parents' house. My parents live about 10, 10 minutes away from me. Uh, they are heading on a vacation for my mom's birthday uh, tomorrow, so I am going to grab a quick bite to eat uh, with them at their house. And then I got a couple errands to run. Um, I want to go, I got to hit Sam's Club and eat some stuff for the next couple weeks. And I want to drop some clothes off at Goodwill. Um, I'd rather donate them to someone who actually needs them rather than just get rid of them. Um, so we're going to try and get that done. And then there's some little stuff around the house. And then we've got, let's see, a hyper leg day today. So we'll hit some legs later. And then I've got a coach, uh, the little guy, second through fifth graders later tonight. So I'm going to get a bite to eat, sipping on my red monster for the first time. Actually, not that bad. Um, never had it before, never actually even seen it before, so kind of interesting, but uh, sipping on that, grab a bite to eat, and then get some stuff done. See you guys later. What's up guys? Uh, just after 3 o'clock, um, been getting, holy cow, a ton of stuff done this afternoon. Um, ran over to my parents' house earlier. Um, grabbed a quick bite to eat with them and then from there I went to Goodwill donated a bunch of stuff to Goodwill um, I'm gonna try this year for the first time I'm not really sure how this works but uh, I got the don donor receipt uh, so I can try and write some of that stuff off on my taxes there's actually a lot of stuff in there uh, a lot of curl clothes from like Express when I was into Express back in the day and I still like some of their stuff, but not as much as I used to. I'm more of kind of a H&M, simple kind of guy right now. Um, Goodwill, uh, did a Sam's Club run, um, stocked up, stocked up fridge, freezer. We got all different types of fish and chicken and turkey, which I've got going on the stove right now. I usually spend... Anytime I really have a day off, I try to get as much cooking done as I can. I cook a lot anyways as it is. Um, chicken about to go down right now. Um, breakfast sandwiches, Brittany likes those. Uh, I'm big on yogurt. I know people are going to be like, oh my god, you eat dairy. Yes, I eat dairy. I eat just about anything I can and want. And still don't gain any weight. So hopefully uh, that changes soon. Uh, put away a bunch of laundry. Did a bunch of laundry. Um, right now, I am watching another one of my uh, YouTube YouTubers that I like to check out, Christian Guzman. Shout out Christian Guzman. Um, his new video looks like it was just put up today. So, 
Um, and then after that, I am taking a mental break to rock out some more of my book. Shout out Josh Altman. I uh, really like that book. I'm only like two chapters in only because it's, it's kind of hard to read uh, like during the day when I'm at work and stuff. And uh, the other day when I was hung over, I really couldn't read much of anything. So uh, I'm going to rock out probably another chapter or so in there. I really like it so far. It's a good read. Pretty easy. Um, yeah, pretty insightful kind of stuff. Just interesting to kind of read. Um, lately, I've, I've liked reading about, you know, success stories. I like, you know, Mark Cuban's, uh, Steve Jobs, things like that. Just just kind of absorbing things that they have to say, um, you know, and, and just kind of brainstorming about how you can apply it to your own life. But that's what's coming up next. Um, at some point before I go coach in about an hour and a half, I've got to get on the phone with uh, my parents' mortgage person and talk to her about getting pre-approved for a home loan which is probably going to be one of the more stressful things I've done in my life. Searching for a house, nowhere near close to buying anything right now, and I'm already stressing out about it, so that should be interesting. And then, hyper leg day tonight, about 6 o'clock, so see you there.